on this day of the festival of atonement, on this day of Yom Kippur, on this day, October 5th, 2022, I would like to call your attention to the fact that we are all sons and daughters, we are all family in the body of Christ. We are all the second coming. On this day of at one minute, of the death of the little ego, of the third dimensional consciousness, of that limited ego awareness separation, each of us are the Christ. We are the second coming. Christ, the word itself, comes from Christos. And a Greek word that means the anointed one or the chosen one. I'm sure you've heard this phrase, perhaps, if you follow along in the chosen one, the Christ, Christos. And let me remind you, if you get any pushback from any, anyone in your environment, your 3D um, network, if you were to look somebody and tell them that you are the second coming of Christ, well, they would uh, perhaps crucify you. I mean, for example, look what happened to the original Christ. Yeshua, Jesus the Christ, when he told them that he was the Christ, what happened to him? They crucified him. No one in this world, this 3D dimensional world of Caesar, of this world, wants to hear about the Christ, the anointed one, the chosen one. Those who are at one mint with source, their I am present, operating from their fifth dimensional perspective of the multidimensional divine union with source consciousness so if you have any personal issue of dealing with religious trauma syndrome with the title christ then consider what the they did to the first christ so become comfortable with the title of christ the chosen one the anointed one step into your the office of the Christ, because the cosmic Christ is the second coming, is the true meaning of the second coming. That we are all in this body of Christ. So there is no more excuses. There is no more scapegoating. There's no Satan. There's no excuse for not living up to what it fully means to be a chosen one, an anointed one with divine source connected awareness with intelligent infinity living divinely being a divine example of the Christ there there's no more half stepping as Big Daddy Kane used to say back in the 80s ain't no half stepping if you're not half stepping please by all means I want you to hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up and become comfortable with this title of the Anointed One, the Chosen One. Namaste, Namaskaram.